हेलो फ्रेंड्स गुड मॉर्निंग गुड आफ्टरनून गुड इवनिंग सो देर इज एन इम्पॉर्टेंट अपडेट ऑन एम ई टी ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर विच इज मनीपाल एंट्रेंस टेस्ट एंड दिस इज रिगार्डिंग मनीपाल काउंसिलिंग एंड द डॉक्यूमेंट अपलोड डेट्स राइट सो दिस इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट अपडेट सो यू वुड हैव ऑल गॉट द मेल फ्रॉम मनीपाल इंस्टीट्यूशन राइट माहे रिगार्डिंग द एडमिशन प्रोसेस फॉर ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फोर एंड इट हैज बीन कन्फर्म नाउ दैट फिफ्टी परसेंट ऑफ वेटेज विल बी given for the boards exams or the 12th class exam or the pu exam and the rest 50% of weightage is there for manipal entrance test but there is a new twist right when it uh, when you talk about the weightage for board exams it will be like maths plus physics plus english which is a surprise addition and plus chemistry and if you are marks are less in chemistry you can choose any other subject which is like from the technical field which can be computer or any of the technical field subjects or civil or mechanical anything which you have taken in class 12 which is of technical nature then chemistry marks can be replaced by that particular subject so it's a mix of four subjects physics maths chemistry english and rest 50% weighted for met exam so now they have requested students to upload their 12th standard mark sheets so for students whom whose 12th class results are out typically the student from different state state boards right which results are declared then you can upload your mark sheet by 6th of may 2024 for all those students whose results are declared but if you are from cbsc or icsc students whose results are not yet declared then they are they have given another date which is 21st of may 2024 for uploading your mark sheets so there are two set of dates for the students whose results are declared and for the students whose results are not declared now let me tell about the important guidelines which is regarding the marks upload which has been provided so they have provided this link which is counseling.manipal.edu where you have to upload all your documents right which is related with your 12th class mark sheets etc and you'll, you they also send the login and uh, password details on your email so i cannot share that but you can go and check your email id there is a complete detail about the login password in that email itself now another important guidelines which they have given about the marks card upload guideline is that you are requested to upload scan copy of 12th marks card and the scan copy should be clearly visible and it should be size it, it should have a size up to 1 mb only and multiple page if any are there in the mark sheet you should attach it as a single pdf only next in case of a photocopy of the document document must be self attested by the candidate or attested by the principal of the college from the where the candidate has completed 10 plus 2 so for all the students who are going to use any photocopies please get it attested by your principal or self attested right the document must contain the name of the board name of the candidate students uh, subject wise marks result status and that is pass and the url from the website where it is downloaded next important thing is that if they find any discrepancy mismatch in the marks and or the forged document then your uh, seat will be automatically cancelled so please don't uh, do those type of things and for all the students whose results are awaiting the last date for them is 21st may right but for the students whose results are declared the last date is 6th may and this is also very important part once you have uploaded your document on counseling.manipal.edu then by default every document which has been uploaded will be in the in progress status if your document is approved by the authority then their status will be changed to approved and those students whose status is changed to approved they don't need to do anything and if the document status is rejected then you are requested to upload your document once again so this is very important so that's all very important update thanks for watching please do subscribe channel and go and check your email it will have login password to join this portal